Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today we will be discussing about the Tableau data models. What they are, how they look like, how we define them. So let's get started. So first of all, what is data model? Data model is nothing. It is just the data source canvas or the page that we see in our Tableau. So this page is called data source page and whatever we create here is called the data model. So Tableau has introduced two type of data models. First is the logical layer. Second is the physical layer. So what is logical and physical layer are? So logical and physical layer are nothing. It's just that uh, earlier 2020, Tableau used to have default one view, which is called the physical layer. Now it has introduced relationships model. So this divides it into two model. One is logical layer, which is also called like relationship or nodules. The other one is the physical layer. That is called Venn diagrams or joints. So let us see like how physical layer is, how it works, how we can do it. So let's go to the Tableau and see it. So first we will connect our Tableau to the sample superstore, which I'm sure everyone is aware about. So first I drag one of the table, which is orders. And second, I drag any table, which is called people. So when you see, right, there is nothing appears as of now. The time I'll put it into the canvas, we'll see one line is appearing. So this line is nothing. It is showing that it is getting combined with the people table on basis of relationship. And whatever we see here, this is called the logical layer of it. So if you hover on, on it, you will see that, okay, what is logical? It is logical table or it is physical table. So when whatever we bring first here, right? So first that we brought the order table so the order table become your root table. Whatever you will bring after it, it will get relationship with it and will always give reference to your order table. So what is the benefit of using relationship? So relationship allow us to bring all these two tables independently. If we go to our page, we will see that all the columns, those are from the order tables are listed irrespective they match with the paper table or not. Right? We have all the columns listed under the order table. All the columns, those belongs to people table are listed to people table. So we'll see here are dimensions, here are measures and uh, we have two different dimensions only. In the paper table, no measure is given. So we see, right, this order count, this paper count. So this is nothing. Earlier, it used to be like uh, with appear with other name, which is number of records. But now it has been uh, modified and gives you the count of the table that you're working with. So this is our physical layer substitute which we can call relationship or logical layer on the other hand right what are the benefits of using the logical layer so logical layer is nothing like it allows us you see i have uh, mentioned some of the uh, benefits over here so first of all it allows us to use the data source independently like it means that we recently show that uh, we have all the columns listed from order table and all the columns listed from people table so we can say that it keep both the data sources independently and other thing is that it do not ask us for to select any type of join it automatically defines and decides what type of join i should put when we pull any type of data so suppose i have customer names here right and I want to see how many people are falling in based region. And what is their regional manager? Right. So 
now you will see right we have one column from other table other column from other table so it de automatically detects what level of information we are showing on the basis of that it will automatically combine the data and will produce the result right so that was one of the benefit second benefit i we just so that all the columns are getting listed here third is that it do not require any type of join that we need to select but it also comes with the relationship limitations of it so the limitation is only is that it do not allow us to choose what type of join we want to use suppose i just want to bring the data which is give popularity or like majorly populations from the audit table only matching column from the people table but that is not possible in relationship it will bring all what is there it will bring all what is there in the people table so this is the logical layer and on the other hand right if we go and see what is the uh, physical layer so physical layer is nothing it just the old type of uh, you can say way combining the data so when we double click on it right first let me go back so if we hover over on it right it will say that this is logical table and it also highlighting that if you want to go to the physical table double click on it we will do double click on it and the same way we will bring the people table so now it is showing us the option which type of join we want to use like we want to use inner join we want to use left join right join full outer join i hope you guys are aware about all these types of joins so we are not going to discuss as of now all them but yes in coming videos we will see how this type of all the joins so here it's saying that okay what is the column that i have to choose from order table what is the column that i have to choose from the people table and on basis of that it will do the join if we are showing inner join selected currently so it will merge the data on the basis of it and will do the data categorization on basis of it we will just click on the cross button and again we are on the this logical table so here right now you will see two things first is logical table another one is the physical table so the logical table is only one it says that order is the only logical table we have up here here because we don't have any other table that is being relationship with it so it says that we have only one table which is called orders but whereas we have two tables right order and people in it this is the physical layer so whenever we use join that is called physical layer and we use relationship that is called logical layer so i have tried to describe it a little bit here i hope you guys have uh, enjoyed it do share your feedback comments and thank you for watching the video we'll see you in next session